watching New York One News all morning. I'm Jill Urban. Moving from one home to another can be a stressful process, but the key to an easy and successful move is using a reliable and reputable mover. Finding the right mover is hard. You really have to do your due diligence, make sure that you put in the time because a bad mover could end up costing you more in the long run. Jenna Wienerman is from Unpack.com, a price comparison and booking site that helps people book reputable movers. She says taking shortcuts when hiring a mover is never a good idea, and she has some tips on how you can make sure you and your stuff are in good hands. First, she says, make sure the company is licensed, insured, and registered with the proper state and federal agencies. Also, look for a better business bureau rating and scour various sites for customer reviews. And watch out for a few things. If the mover demands cash only on move day, I'd probably run for the hills. If you look at their website and they don't have the physical address, the phone number on the website, if they're not willing to answer your questions, and if they tell you that all of your goods are fully insured, it's probably not true. She says the most common issue on move day is a price spike when an hourly move takes much longer than expected. So she recommends finding a mover that offers a flat rate all-inclusive move. Also, it's good to have the mover come to your home to see all your inventory for an accurate estimate. And be aware of what coverage is included and find out if you should buy more. Some movers will tell you that you'll receive 30 cents a pound, 60 cents a pound for your goods. In reality, do the math yourself. If you have a 20 pound TV, you'll be getting six to eight dollars for your TV. So make sure you know exactly what kind of valuation you're getting. Now it's also important that you understand all the terms of the contract. In the craziness of a move, it's easy to skim through the paperwork and quickly sign. But you should really take the time to read the fine print to avoid any problems later on. And finally, the best way to have a smooth move is to make sure you or someone close to you is there to supervise the packing, loading, and moving. This will help you avoid being unsettled as you settle in to your new home. Jill Urban, New York One.